damn, Tom Felton must really love playing a douchebag. Hey everybody, this is 22 Tiger Dude and I'm here to review Bell. So, Bell stars Juju Mbatha-Ra, Tom Wilkinson, Miranda Richardson, Penelope Wilton, Matthew Good, Tom Felton, and Emily Watson. This is a period piece film. It's based on a true story and the story is about really this African American girl that gets raised by her great uncle. And there's the time where, you know, racism is going on, so she can't go out in public because of the fact that she is black. There's more to the story, but I don't want to get into all the details. Going into this film, I was pretty interested in it because I do enjoy these period piece films, and it just felt so good to see another one. Belle, in my opinion, is a good period piece film. I found it to be really interesting. The storyline is so Solid at best, all the performances are really good. The costumes, actually, they look tremendous. Compliments to whoever created the costumes for this film because two major thumbs up for that. I was really invested in this whole storyline with Belle, everyone calls her Dido, but the actress who plays her, I know I just finished butchering her name right now, I don't want to say it again out of respect, but she did do a really good job playing Belle, and she provided a lot of emotion for the character, and she was by far one of the strongest points of the film, I just thought she did a really great job. We also have Tom Wilkinson, who plays the great uncle that has raised her and took her in, and I thought he did a tremendous job here. Emily Watson's really good here. Matthew Good is really good here. Miranda Richardson, who plays Belle's cousin, she did a really good job here as well. And even though Tom Felton plays a douchebag, he did do a good job in his role. There was a whole interesting storyline about what Tom Wilkinson is up to. It's based on a true story, so how they did tell it was very interesting to me. And the film does do a good job making you feel you're in that time period. My only problems with Belle would be that there were a couple of moments that did feel a little dragged in my opinion. There were a few times where the film cuts to the next scene rapidly like this scene happens and then it just cuts quickly to the next scene making the editing feel kind of off. While Tom Felton did do a good job with his role I thought his screen time wasn't used quite properly. It was as if the director or writer weren't quite sure what to do with his screen time. Something about his screen time just felt a little off. And also, there was a certain event that involves Tom Felton's character. You see him with Belle. I believe that's the last time you see him. And then, after what happens, you don't see him all of a sudden for the rest of the film. So, it's just so weird how the film did that, in my opinion. And I also did feel like the ending, while it was interesting, I was satisfied how it concluded. It was rushed. Overall, I thought Bell was a very well-made period piece film. If you enjoy these period piece movies, then I definitely think you'll enjoy Bell. It's very well made. It looks beautiful. The performances are all very good. The storyline, how it's told, was interesting. And I just liked how this film was put together overall. So I'm going to give Bell three out of four stars. I am 22 Tiger Dude. Don't forget, the owl always have Tiger Power!